Welcome back. I'm Cassium. Yay. And this is Swartor. Alright, I think we got everything and everyone talked to that we needed to. While away from the shipmaster, perhaps I should create non-perishable meals to send with you. Maybe you should shut the hell up. Alright. Training and skills. New player. Let's get rid of... Eh. That's better. Travel through the world. Can we go? There we go. Lieutenant, this is General Garza. I see that you've touched down on Nar Shaddaa. Before we begin your briefing, I want to make something clear. The situation on Nar Shaddaa is very delicate. Hmm. This moon belongs to the Hutt Cartel, who take their neutrality very seriously. The Republic cannot afford any incidents. What exactly should I be avoiding here, sir? Imperial personnel operate just as freely on Nar Shaddaa as we do. You cannot be caught taking action against them. Now, your mission. An experimental Republic war droid has gone rogue, committing a series of seemingly random attacks across Nar Shaddaa. The droid's designation is M14X, and it is my belief that this droid is acting under orders from Harren Tavis. What makes you say that? The droid is a highly advanced prototype, one that was being developed to serve in Havoc Squad. The project was supposed to have been cancelled, but it would seem Tavis simply shifted the development elsewhere, most likely his allies in the Sith Empire. Hmm. Why wasn't the project completed in the first place? The droid's design relied on an exotic alien power source, but our technicians couldn't make it work efficiently. This war droid's rampage must be stopped before it's linked with the Republic. An agent of the Strategic Information Service will be assisting you. Officially, you're providing military support to an SIS operation. Do not divulge Tavis's defection or the droid's connection to it. You can count on me, sir. Be careful, Lieutenant. If this war droid is even half as dangerous as its original designers had estimated, you'll have your work cut out for you. Garza out. Okay, we had an inspection of it. Everything's still there. Yeah, Alright, I'll get this there. Seems legitimate to me. Yay, 21. Just in time to go in the bar, we're 21. Alright. In the green door we go. Ah, there you are. Go ahead, take a seat, and keep your voice down. I didn't come here to play your little spy games, if you say so. Hope you like the cantina. It's not one of my favorites, but it is conveniently located. There's a vault not far from here. It's a merc operation. Holds valuables for anybody with the credits to pay. Our mutual friend is about to pay them a visit. Do we have a welcome party arranged? Not exactly. No. A group of paramilitary types always shows up on the scene before the droids attacks. We've already spotted them casing the vault. You could head in now, but I don't want to scare them off. We wouldn't want the guest of honor to skip the party, would we? It's your show, Jonas. When do we make our move? 
I have people with eyes on the vault. Once they spot our target, we'll get the party started. So, Havoc Squad, huh? Pretty nice of Garza to loan us her very best. I'm, uh, excuse me. Jonas, I just wanted to let you know I made it to Ithor safe and sound. That's great. I'll talk to you later then. That's our cue. The target is in the vault. Are you ready to move out? Let's get this party started. Take care of the droid, and we'll have you on your way within the hour. Nice and tidy. Good luck. We'll have our eyes on you. Awkward. Lonus, you're the very best. For this shit, yeah. We wouldn't be here if we weren't just chasing down a couple of turds in a bucket. They keep floating around in there. Now how in the fuck is that conveniently located, my dude? I mean, for serious. How about you conveniently locate your ass closer to where we gotta go? If they're already in there, you think I would already have been on my way? Good God. What are they gonna do, spend a couple hours in there, tinking around? Vehicle pads are currently oh, for God's for sakes, really? Have a safe and pleasant stay. Wasting time. There's an entire galaxy full of depraved lunatics plotting against our great republic, and we're busy rummaging for valuables. Be patient, Forex. Black ops are cheap. Commander Tavis needs us to be resourceful. But I've been operational for days now. Imperial vermin across the galaxy should be cursing the republic ingenuity that created me. You know you're not actually serving the republic here, right? Contact. Arm subject. Engage and terminate. Negative. Subjects confirmed as Republic Army personnel. Fellow heroes in our war on evil and oppression. Great. Look, this is a top secret mission. Commander Tavis sent us himself. Does Havoc Squad Commander Tavis mean anything to you? I'm the commander of Havoc Squad. Tavis is a traitor to the Republic. Tavis isn't the traitor. He was betrayed. And there are some of us who aren't standing for it. Forex, secure the package and follow me. The rest of you, gun this scum down and rendezvous with us at Objective 7. Negative. What you suggest is an act of betrayal. The murder of fellow... M1 Forex, override code 558. Secure the objective and follow me now. Sir, yes, sir. I'm your commanding officer. Ignore this man's orders. Negative. Override code condition 558. Obey only orders given by Commander Heron Tavis, or personnel designated by same. Let's go! Move! Move! Open fire! Someone clean up this mess! Oh, that was shit. Oh, it's over there. Yeah, this... Hold on, I gotta fix this. My old monitor was like... I didn't realize it was way bigger than this one, though. Well, 
That was interesting, wasn't it? Hmm. Huh. Any idea where the droid went? We've got a pretty solid lead. Our tap on the vault cams wasn't perfect, but the droid's crew looked like they were packing Republic heat. All standard issue. We didn't have audio, though. Any luck finding out who we're dealing with? They were Republic Special Forces soldiers who have defected to the Empire alongside Heron Tavis. Defections in Spec Force? That's news. Big news. Any particular reason SIS isn't in the loop on this? General Garza made it clear that she didn't want SIS involved. Ah. So, you're taking a pretty big risk giving me the whole story on this. Thanks. But, we'll talk later. Our new traitor friends have holed up in an abandoned arms factory in the red light sector. I have a team setting up shop in a warehouse not far from the arms factory. Meet up with us there. Well... Alright. Move out ASAP. Keep your eyes open. The red light sector isn't exactly the safest place in the galaxy. See you soon. Is that piece of junk better yet? Yeah. Maybe a little. Maybe not. Maybe not at all. Get out of there. A little bit. Add that and it'd be quite a bit. Yeah, that's better. Alright, so we gotta get out of here, 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 and there, and everywhere. Wants us to fly somewhere over the rainbow, I take it. Welcome. Please select an available travel route. Ooh, slowed that one down. Hey there! Welcome to Balker Interior Refurbishments Incorporated. Be sure you review the new employee manual. As long as we're holding a position, it's best to stay inconspicuous. Exactly. You've got a knack for this business. I've got bad news. The droid and his friend gave us the slip just after you and I spoke on the holo. They jumped into an access tunnel and blew it behind themselves. Tracking them down again is going to take time. Do we have some kind of backup plan? If these men are traitors, then they'll have Imperial supervisors. We just need to find out where. I'll bet these guys would call for help if you shot up their arms factory. Then we trace that call straight to whoever's really in charge. That's a good plan. Let's make it happen. First things first, you'll need to plant these signal trackers around the arms factory so that we can trace the distress call. Then you kick down the door and do what you do best while we see who gets a call. Sound like a plan? Time to wreck a little havoc. We'll be waiting for you here when the party's over. Have fun. Tap on to Lou. Blow it up, baby. Blow it up. Now let's see where we gotta go here. Just up the road, eh? Perfection. Way better than, hey, drive across the map. Now drive back across the map. Ah. Son of a bitch. Yeah, still a bit of a drive. Should have paused for this. And you didn't have to sit here all bored. My apologies. Could have just got straight to the blowing shit up. What the hell? Not even a challenge. Damn, son. Someone clean up this You're a mess. fighter. It's too easy. Too 
challenge. And stay down. Damn it. Someone clean up this mess. Not even a challenge. Too easy. Pretty sure we cleared that area out pretty well. Where's the button? No, the whole thing on the other side. Wow, missed that. Mama, shave me, mama. Seems legit to me. <sighs> now, was that fun, or was that fun? It was quite a performance, and if our signal trackers are accurate, you pulled in a very interesting audience. Were you able to find the imps our traders are working for? The alarm signal from the arms factory led to a surprising place, a penthouse at the Club Vertica Casino. The slicers tell me that the computer systems at the other end of the alarm signal were definitely imperial. Apparently, our friends are overseeing this operation in style. I'll breach the casino penthouse and eliminate all imperials present. Whoa, not so fast. Club Vertica is an extremely public place. We have to get you through the casino and up to the penthouse without any bloodshed. Fine. That's where my friend Niall Piv comes in. Niall's our top slicer here. He'll make sure nobody hassles you on the way to the penthouse. Hmm. What's up, Niles? Pleasure to meet you, Niall. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, thanks. Uh, it's nice to meet you, too. Club Vertica has a safe list, a list of people allowed to go in and out of the penthouse at any time. It's Niall's job to get you added to that safe list, but he needs your help. Hmm? Oh, uh, yes, Club Vertica's systems are highly secured. The only way to add you to the safe list is from inside the system. There's a substation down in the lower industrial sector. It belongs to the casino, so its computers are tied into the casino systems. We need you to get Niall inside. Hell yeah. I'll make it happen. Security for the substation is heavy. The casinos contracted some of the priciest mercenaries around. Good luck to you. Oh no, we don't need luck. We need bigger bullets. <laughs> Alright, let's see where the hell we gotta go. Oh yeah, exactly what I thought. We're gonna be on another space mission. Inside of a city that's the size of Rhode Island. Welcome. Please oh, yeah, travel. baby. So we didn't need to do that at all, my friend. Let's see if we can skip half of this flight automatically, instantly. Have a safe and pleasant stay. Oh, I'll Welcome. do that. Please select an available oh, travel. that's better, ain't it? Hopefully. It's just a little... Uh, son of a bitch. It's a long walk. Eh, see you in a minute. <laughs> there was a lot of monsters on the way here. I skipped most all of them. Alright, I skipped every one of them. Just keep me covered and I'll take care of everything for you. Okay. I'll hide by him by here, here, right here. <clears throat> I'll hide here and jump out and scare people. Ready? 
Let's do this. Okay, okay, let's see here. Good, good, okay, perfect. The primary access protocol is bypassed. Now we just need to start with some priority data changes to cover our real moves. Does that mean things are going well? Sorry? Oh, yes, um, they're using the old 15Rs, so this shouldn't take long. I'm just making a few system changes before I add you to the safe list, which should keep their technicians distracted from what we're really doing. Hmm, daily income reports, year-by-year -year earning estimates, VIP profiles. Boska, hugwa Boska, They you. sure do use Tanovic for a lot of random shit, don't they? What's up, Buttercup? I really need my fully automatic. Not even a challenge. Okay. 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 There. That should do it. That should do nicely. Sweet. You've got me on that safe list pretty fast, Nile. Huh? Oh, uh, no. I I'm not finished. That was just the fun transfer. I just moved some credits around so it would look like someone skimmed the casino's accounts, so no one would check the safe list. I'm adding you to the safe list now. Just a little longer. Alright, one more time. Perfect. Just perfect. Oh, calm your tits. I you love this. Bosca. See? He's back again. The fuck? How many times do I gotta shoot you in the head, dude? Alright, alright. I can make it. I can make it from here. Whew. Thank you. Thanks for covering me. You Man, really we ran like 20 feet. You're welcome. You better head for Club Vertica, up in the promenade. I'll let Jonas know everything went okay. And after that, I'm taking a week off. I'll see you around. Good luck. Well, okay. Now we gotta go back to the club. Son of a bitch, I don't wanna go back to the club. Well, let's get there. Hey there, soldier. Niall just made it back and told me how much heat you took on covering for him. Mm -hmm. You two did great. You're on the safe list. Our tracks are covered. And I've even tapped into all of the casino security cams. I'll be able to keep an eye on everything. Make sure nobody gets the drop on you. Sounds good to me. I appreciate you watching my back. That's exactly there, what I clicked. You'll need all the help you can get. You're walking into a hell of a situation here, Lieutenant. Questioning the imps about the droid is one thing. But if this comes down to shooting, the Republic can't afford that risk. If anyone starts trouble, it won't be me. That's all we can ask of you. All right. I won't hold you any longer. Get up to that penthouse and get us some answers. And don't get yourself killed doing it. Jonas out. Alright. Jonas. Brother. See you on the other side. Into the penthouse we're gonna go. Rocket boots we're gonna know. This is the funnest part, traveling. Yeah. Yeah. Wanted to get up there and dance with the hookers. Wow, you're a big bitch. I'm like three foot tall. Alright, probably gotta go up, up, up here. Alright, so let's do that. Because why the hell wouldn't they put an elevator there? It looks so much cooler having this crap. That way you can come out here and lord over your highly popular place, like all four people that are in here. <sighs> it's not even an awesome club. Should have been like a rave.
Sir! Intruders! Possible. Throw down your weapons, Republic scum. You have no idea what you've done breaking in here. I'm sorry. The guy at the front desk must have made a mistake. You're caught. Don't even try to talk your way out of it. Final warning. Drop your weapons and surrender. Now! If I wanted you dead, I would have just slagged the whole casino. This is a social visit. This visit is over. Subdue the intruders, men. Use whatever forces... Zardrix, this is Andrik. We got the last package and we're heading for object... Oh, oh this is too much. Shut up, Andrik. Can't you see we have a situation here? Just tell me where to find M14X and there won't be any trouble. The Empire does not negotiate with scum like you. Have fun dying, Zardrix. At least I'll have time to double our patrols while you and your men are being slaughtered. What? Don't be ridiculous! We'll have this situation dealt with in mere moments! Nah. In mere moments, you'll be dead. And the situation will be headed my way. Nice knowing you. That treacherous, disrespectful... Doesn't sound like Andrik cares about the Empire at all. Why protect him? Andrik may be scum, but his droid's activities are useful to the Empire. I cannot allow you to impede their work. Andrik isn't loyal to you or the Empire. He'll turn on you, just like he turned on the Republic. You're right. Andrik is scum, unworthy of the Imperial resources that protect him. You will find Captain Andrik and M14X in a facility deep within the Shadow Town District, unlocking the droid's full potential. That machine's power core is capable of far more than your scientists thought possible. Soon, M14X will have shields and weapons more powerful than any other droid ever created. Sounds like I'd better double time it. You'll be too late to stop the droid, but you might at least manage to kill Andrik, which suits me. Now go. You have what you wanted. Leave before I change my mind. Oh, and tell Captain Andrik that it was nice knowing him, too. Farewell. Lieutenant, it's Jonas. I saw you talking to the imps. Nobody shot anybody, so I'm going to take that as a good sign. Did you find out where our missing droid is gone? The droid is in a facility in Shadow Town. Repeat, Shadow Town. Fantastic work. I knew we could count on you. Shadow Town is where the imps put people who are too useful to kill, but too dangerous to leave roaming around the galaxy. It's dangerous and heavily secured. Fighting your way in won't be the easiest thing you've ever done. Hmm. Dangerous ops are always the most fun. It's up to you to finish this. Get in, trash the droid, and get yourself out so we can call it a day. Sounds legit to me, brother man. Where do you want us to be now? Let's head on over there. Be careful. Ready. Hmm. I forgot to pull this chick out. Whip her out. Need to get some levels on you, girl. Contact. 
Just a little. Burning up all my juice. All right, come on. Definitely need to get my firepower up. Time to up the armor. Get a couple more skills here. Good lordy. Hello, you sneaky little bugger. There we go. It's a little bit better. So here you are, a little later than I was expecting, to be honest. Did it really take you that long to wipe out Zardris and his men? Maybe you're not as good as I thought you were. Sorry. There's just so much to see and do on Nar Shaddaa. Idiot. If you'd have gotten here sooner, you might have actually had a chance. You make me sick. You kill good men, fellow soldiers, all because some scumbag on Coruscant said they were traitors? Your loyalties are all wrong. When you're bleeding out in a trench on some muckball planet, it ain't High Command that pulls you out. It's the guy next to you. You betrayed the Republic. It doesn't matter why. Blind. Blind and stupid. I'll bet you can't even imagine doing something you weren't ordered to do. Come on, hurry up. Easy kill. I have completed the charging process. All systems operable. Sounds like your time's up, Lieutenant. Have any last... Lieutenant, you made it! I knew this imp-loving scum could never escape the sure justice of the Republic for long! You're still forced to follow Andrik's commands? Unfortunately, I am still bound by my programming to obey Captain Andrik. The coward has naturally ordered me to kill you. To be used this way against the finest agents of my beloved Republic shames me. Oh, I wish I had never been activated. You never chose to be a traitor. Whether by choice or not, I am acting as a traitor. Worthy only of scorn and summary obliteration. Enough chatter. It's time to finish this. Lieutenant. Hmm. Be advised that your weapon will require several decades of sustained fire in order to penetrate my shields at their current charge. Seeing as Republic Spec Force training is the best in the galaxy, I'm confident you'll find an alternative solution for my destruction. No shit, thanks Come for on. the tip. I appreciate the tip, Forex. It is my pleasure to at least serve the Republic in this small way. Enough! Open fire! What's up, little buddy?
Eh. Definitely need my other abilities here. Oh, okay. Thought I had to do it twice. Didn't you just have to do both of those? And easy as that. Easy as pie. Lieutenant, I'm with the SIS. What is your status? Do you require medical attention? My Medicare has me covered. Thanks. Excellent. We'll get straight to work then. We're here to clean up the mess, make sure there's nothing useful to be recovered. Nice work, by the way. Jonas is waiting for you inside the Republic Embassy, up on the promenade. He asked that you meet him there for a debriefing. I'll head for the Embassy right away. Glad I got a chance to meet you, Lieutenant. And again, nice work. Mm -hmm. Reapers fed out! Standard grid formation! Hmm. That was that, huh? Whoop the shit out of a miniature droid. Where, oh, where do you want us to go now? Good day to you. Good day to you. And to you. Meep. Welcome. Please select an available travel route. I don't want to. I want no available travel routes. I want the ones that are not available. Have a safe and pleasant Let's stay. On, shall we? Let's move on, shall we? That's easier said than done. No, it ain't. Pull your ears off. It's that easy. Vehicle pads are currently uh, open uh, for business. Kidding. Let's go. Come on, girl. Let's get in the truck. Let's get her done. Oh, look, a lovely pea fountain. That's disgusting. Why would you have a pea fountain? Yuck. Nobody wants to fight. How rude. Boring. Which is why you shouldn't have tried to hide this from us. How can the SIS do its job if you lie to us? You are in no position to demand anything from me, Agent Balker. I will conduct Special Forces Affairs as I see fit. Treason? Mass defection? You're covering up a threat to the entire Republic. I'm back. The operation was a success. Yes, the operation. That's just what we were discussing. What were you thinking, Lieutenant? I gave you specific orders, and you ignored them. Not everyone can deceive their allies, General. Some people actually have standards. What's done is done. You're absolutely right. This discussion is over. Lieutenant, contact me on your ship's hollow when everything with M14X has been settled. Garza out. Ugh. <sighs> I don't know how you work with that woman. The job got done, and it was no small feat. You've definitely earned your reward. I just did my duty, Jonas. Nothing more. I'm afraid modesty isn't going to get you out of this one. <clears throat> Republic war droid M14X is to be repaired and direct control transferred to Havoc Squad's current commanding officer immediately. Want to go meet the newest member of your squad, Lieutenant? <laughs> No. Absolutely, Jonas. Come on, follow me. Wasn't even hard to whoop his ass. All right, that should wrap things up. Activating now. Diagnostics complete. All systems operational. Unit M14X reporting for duty. Welcome to Havoc Squad, M14X. Lieutenant, I'm very pleased to see you again. Your work in disabling me was incredible. Republic soldiers obviously are the best in the galaxy. It will be an honor to fight alongside such an exceptional servant of the Republic. Together, we shall crush the mindless hedonist of the Sith Empire. Will your shields and weapons be as powerful as they were when we fought? Unfortunately, no. Your skillful assault reduced my power core's charge back to its baseline. But this is only a temporary situation. Over time, my power core will gradually recharge, increasing my effectiveness until I can once again slay the Republic's depraved enemies with impunity. It's been a pleasure working with you, Lieutenant. Hopefully the next time we meet we'll be under more honest circumstances. See you around, Jonas. See you around, Lieutenant. Toodles. 
Goodbye. Au revoir. Now I gotta go get my ass ripped. That's easier said than done. Sir? Yes, sir. That's easier said than done. Sure is. Yeah. What's up? Why are you talking to me? Stop talking. Ah, Lieutenant. There you are. Do I need to reiterate my disappointment in your decision to intentionally disobey orders and reveal the spec force defections to the SIS? Or yeah. has that been made suitably clear? No, you should. You should spank me. I've been very naughty. Clear, General. It won't happen again. I'm glad to hear it. As for the mission itself, I'm satisfied. You've stopped Tavis's plans for the M14X and returned a valuable asset to Republic Service. Well done. Huh. I'm glad you approved, General. Of course, you did almost plunge the entire galaxy into a war just to accomplish this mission. Please try to avoid that sort of thing in the future. I'll try to be more careful from now on. Now, I've just received some intelligence that I want Havoc to act on immediately. It's Tavis. He and a team of commandos just raided a Republic Research Center on Kalarin and stole a prototype cloaking device. But the prototype contains a tracking beacon. We now know the exact location of Tavis's ship. This is it, Lieutenant. I can move on Tavis's position immediately, General. Tavis's ship is currently sitting alone in an empty sector of space, most likely waiting to rendezvous with a larger vessel. You have to get there before that happens, Lieutenant. I'll head there immediately. This is Harren Tavis himself, Lieutenant. Succeed here, and everything else becomes an afterthought. What are my orders, General? Capture or neutralize? He could be useful to us alive, but take no chances. We cannot afford to let Tavis escape. Be sure to secure the prototype cloaking device after you've dealt with Tavis. If it fell into the Empire's hands, it could be disastrous. I'm transmitting the coordinates to you now. Affect entry to Tavis' ship, then do whatever is necessary to neutralize him and retrieve the prototype. Good hunting. Garza out. Toodles, Garza. Toodles. What's up, Dorn? Sir, I... I feel I owe you an apology. After we spoke with Captain Kalor, I was unnecessarily curt with you. You've been very supportive. That hasn't always been the case with Republic personnel I've dealt with since defecting. I wouldn't be much of a CO if I didn't watch out for my people. It's greatly appreciated, sir. People distrust me as soon as I speak. They only hear my accent. Even when I'm not a potential spy, I'm a resource. Endless questions about Imperial culture, personnel, military procedures. It's exhausting. You're a good soldier, Dorn. Don't worry about what other people expect. Thank you, sir. I really don't complain by nature. Mistrust and inconvenience are a small price to pay for a clear conscience. I don't regret defecting to the Republic at all. Despite my past, I was allowed to join the military, earn commendations and serve in the Republic's most elite squad. I'm very fortunate. The Republic is lucky to have you. Thank you. I'm very proud to be here. Huh. Well, level six. Sir, I wondered if I might ask a personal question about the former Havoc Squad member's defection. What was it like to have your commander and comrades join the enemy? How did you feel? I was shocked. I never saw it coming. Tavis and the others must have been hiding their plans very carefully. I've always wondered how my family took the news of my defection. It must have been difficult for them to understand. Your family is still in the Empire? Oh yes. The Dawns are very proud of their history within the Empire. Members of the Dawn family have served with distinction in the Imperial military for generations. It's an important family tradition. It isn't easy to reach prominence in the Empire with no aptitude for the Force. But my family did it. I hope they're all still well. It can't be easy to fight against your family's side. It is a consequence I accepted when I chose to defect. I don't give it a second thought. Huh. Well, 
Alright then. Kablamo. Well, that ain't bad. Level 7. What are you doing, Greenhorn? Bad news, sir. I just received a dispatch from command. It's my old sniper squad, the Dead Eyes. They've been captured. Happened during a routine officer hunt. Somehow the imps got the drop on them and rounded up the entire unit. Careless. How long have the Dead Eyes been in Imperial custody? Weeks. More than enough time to be marched in front of a firing squad. Look, something about this doesn't sit right with me. The Dead Eyes area of operation was on Nar Shida. That's hot territory. Neutral ground. They shouldn't have had any business operating there. Hmm. Huh. You think there's more going on here? Can't say yet. I need to know what happened to the Dead Eyes. And if they're still alive. Missions on Nar Shida are usually greenlit by the SIS. With your permission, I'd like to meet with them. See what they know. Get a hold of Jonas Balker. He may be able to help us. Your call. We'll rendezvous at the dive he hangs out in. With any luck, he'll have something for us. <laughs> Boop. Hmm. We're stinky. Ain't here yet. Hmm. Alright, I guess that's it for today. This is where we leave it. We'll go whoop some ass tomorrow. And I will see you guys then. Bye!